The head of the International Olympic Committee, IOC, Thomas Bach spoke about the suspension of Russian and Belarusian athletes from international competitions because of the situation in Ukraine. Many national Olympic committees have wondered what makes this situation unique and where the same measures were taken when wars were waged in Afghanistan, Syria, Yemen, Mali, Ethiopia and other countries. There are a lot of crises. The answer is that this is a blatant violation of the Olympic truce. We had to take protective measures because the world reaction to the listed wars was not the same as during the start of the special operation in Ukraine. Our Olympic values imply holding peaceful competitions between all athletes of all national Olympic committees, Box said. Deputy of the State Duma of the Russian Federation, Dmitry Svishchev, said that representatives of the UAE are interested in cooperation with Russia in the field of sports. Following my meeting with the representative of the UAE, I can say that the Arab partners are interested in attracting Russian experience in organizing and holding sports events. We are ready to cooperate in the field of esports to host competitions in various sports, including some winter ones. And what is even more positive they are ready to host the seasonal training camps of Russian athletes. And we are committed to fruitful and mutually beneficial cooperation, Svishchev said.